we thought it'd been, I mean, it'd been five years since the last Guitar Hero. And we thought, uh, as, as freestylers, we were like, we're not going to bring it back unless we had some really cool things to kind of bring to the table. There's new consoles. There's probably a whole generation of, of gamer that maybe hasn't had a chance to play Guitar Hero yet. So we thought that now was the right time to do it. We wanted to do something completely different. So um, that's why we came with a new controller. We're focusing on guitar with this one as well. So we've got a new button layout. We've got live action uh, videos. So you're actually the rock star. We, we rock the real crowds, we like to say. So we put the camera into your head, first person. And we actually use the same um, robotic rig they use for the Lord of the Rings. So we've got, we filmed one side where everything is going great. Your bandmates love you. The crowd loves you. On the other side, you're playing terribly. Uh, your bandmates are, are kind of looking at you like they, they've never seen you play this bad before. The crowd's throwing stuff at you. They're booing you. And then we seamlessly transition between those two to kind of give you a unique experience. It was really difficult for a lot of players to, to kind of go above the medium level. So with ours, you start out with three fingers on the bottom row. So we've got the two by three button layout. You start out nice and easy. As you step up the difficulty, you kind of sort of transition to that top row of buttons. Get into advanced, it gets more chord shapes. You can actually do bar chords in this version now. And then all the way up to the top difficulty level, which gets uh, pretty tricky. So. It's really easy for new players to learn. It's going to be easy for old GH players to come back. But if you were a pro before, you've got a new challenge here. <laughs> Heavy movie. The Sheriff's Department temporarily shut down 40...